I'm out for a walk on my lunch break at work right now because, one, it's an absolutely beautiful day outside and, you know, I want to at least get a little bit of time out in the sun before, you know, it gets evening time. And you know, It's still sunny out, but it's just not the same as being out during the middle of the day. And uh, I obviously made a poor choice in wardrobe by wearing black, even though, you know, it's not super hot out, but it's warm enough and I'm on my way back and starting to get a little bit sweaty, which is gross. <laughs> hey, in case you noticed, I'm not wearing my glasses. It's because I made a major fail today and forgot not only my glasses at home, but also forgot my phone charger, which wouldn't be a big deal except for the fact that the Droid ones suck up battery like nothing else you've ever heard of. Uh, well, I'm sure there are other phones that suck up the battery even worse, but yeah, this one goes pretty quick. <laughs> Mmm, tequila. You know the song, don't you? Tequila? Get away from me while I have hot stuff. Tequila! Cute and fuzzy. Are you ashamed, Ketson? <laughs> Go limp! <laughs> <laughs> She's listening to me. So does anyone else think that the new um, Katy Perry song, uh, Last Friday Night, basically sounds like a watered-down Kesha song? And by watered down, I mean it doesn't sound as much like it's on crack and on a badass trip. Just curious. We have just witnessed what very well could be the first sweet season victory. It is a momentous occasion. It is. Watch as they come back into the dugout, completely unaware that they have just won. Why do they know? I don't know. Oh, there's the victory hand slaps. And the red have won. Today, red means go, and green means you lose. Will with the BBC, signing off. Apparently I was wrong. This was in fact their second victory. I have shamed myself as a journalist, and for that I apologize, and I will hit my head against the wall upon reaching my homestead. Thank you and good night. For the sake of playing catch-up, I'm probably going to give the recording a rest for a few days. That way I can focus on editing the trip to South Carolina and the last few days, including today so I can get them online, and from there on, I probably won't record as often as I have been these last few times, and maybe try and see if I can focus on things that are more interesting as opposed to just everyday things, because while these vlogs are primarily for family and even friends that might, you know, have some curiosity as to, you know, what I'm doing, even though these videos show little to no actual insight to my life, other than the fact that I'm insane, uh, yeah, I want to try and, you know, if more people start watching these vlogs and hopefully the new channel that I'm working on, which uh, I already have the idea for, there's actually several ideas for um, the videos I'm going to be posting on there, one of which will hopefully be recorded within the next week. Um, yeah, just want to, like I was getting back on topic, I just want to try and focus and make sure that they're good vlogs, quality vlogs as opposed to just random things that I think of. Although there will be plenty of that as well because I like to be weird and annoy Jill occasionally and other people, as you can tell. <laughs>
I just checked and noticed that what I said for the last two minutes or so, maybe just closer to one, was insanely blurry. So, sorry about that, but I really don't feel like saying all that again. It's as soon as I hit the record button that you get out of the box. And now you're on the pillow. You're a brat. She knows.